Natty, aren't I? Come down, my friends, and listen to what an ultra-modern has to say. That's it, gal around. Now, it's true we're colleagues in the same business, but I must say I can do the same job as you much quicker. And what matters in the kitchen today is saving time, and, of course, saving fuel, which can equally well be gas, electricity, or anything else. And that's why I'm here. Oh, I know all of you are doing good work in the kitchen, but I can cook the same meal as you in a quarter of the time. Think of it. You and who else? <laughs> Me, if you like. I'm known as the cook's bottle. I have a handle to my name, too. You see, I have a cousin, but of course I never let him come to the table. Maybe. But even you folk need the help of human hands. <laughs> and even they can't be relied upon, can they? Oh, we're quite simple to operate, really. Wait until you see me in action. Quick, here comes Mrs. Martin. Back into the cupboard. Hurry. <laughs> Mrs. Martin is a typical modern housewife. She wants to be a good cook in less time than it takes to be a mediocre one. Oh, I'm the chap for her, all right. My, and am I handsome, made of the finest deep-drawn aluminium with a thick base. Listen, boys, I'm going to tell her all about myself. Ready? Here goes. Now, take this black knob, for instance. It's used for sealing my lid, and this little chap here is the pressure control lever. Beneath it is the pressure control. Here's my safety plug. When locked, this safety shield covers the plug. You see, I'm perfectly safe and foolproof. And these two heat-resisting plastic handles help to make me less cumbersome and more maneuverable. Or maybe you'd like my saucepan handle. It's all a matter of choice. We both do the same job. <laughs> Can I cook? Oh, <laughs> I'll show you. First, see how my cover's removed. Press black knob down. Turn clockwise until blue dots meet. Lift cover and ease towards you. Let's have another look. Press black knob down. Turn clockwise until the blue dots meet, ease towards you and lift out. Simple, isn't it? All what you've just heard goes for me too. I like the same sort of treatment. Joe will be home in half an hour, just time to get dinner ready. That prestige cook of the godsend. I think I'll do a savoury beef stew. I must brown the meat first, so in go two tablespoons of dripping. So it's to be a savoury beef stew, eh? Well, I'll soon melt that dripping. And just as soon as it's melted, in will go the meat in order to brown it. I do this job excellently, by the way. In it goes. Let me see. Let me see. I want to do that. You hear me? I want to do the browning. <laughs> oh, steady on there. Don't be too curious. My goodness. I was quite sure that cupboard was shut. Well, it didn't take me long to get that meat brown, did it? Now, the next job is to add one bay leaf, two teaspoons of salt, a quarter of a teaspoon of pepper, and two measuring cupfuls of water. A measure is supplied with me, and you fill it twice for the correct amount. After this, you help me on with my cover. Insert blue dot on lid under the blue dot on rim, fit crossbar into handle slots, press black knob down, and turn anti-clockwise as far as it will go. My lid then snaps into place, and before you can say prestige, I'm sealed and ready to cook. Don't forget you do the same for me, too. See that the lever on my pressure control is up, 
This allows the air inside to escape. When I begin steaming like this, flip the lever down. This builds up my pressure. Well, I soon let you know when pressure is up because I start hissing like this. I'm a lusty lad when I get going. You turn the heat low once pressure is up and start counting cooking time. In this case, it's 10 minutes. Now, my boss doesn't waste time, so she utilizes these precious moments for preparing her vegetables. Mm, vegetables have different cooking times. The book said that this could be evened up, so I'll leave the onions as they are. I'll cut the potatoes into quarters, and likewise the carrots. And of course, I must cut the celery into short lengths. Now they'll all cook in the same time. Of course, if you were cooking vegetables without meat, you would use the prestige separators with easy lifting handles like these so that the vegetables could be kept apart in the cooker. So if you don't want mixed company, these separators can be used in either of us. Yes, I know, six o'clock. Ten minutes are now up and my pressure must be reduced. This is done by first pouring cold water over me. <laughs> Ever followed a hot bath with a cold shower? Now you flip up my pressure control lever before removing my lid. Now off with my cover. Remember, it's black knob down, turn clockwise until dots meet. Lift to clear slot, ease towards you and lift out. Now pop in those vegetables. In they go. So it's on with my cover. Crossbar into handle slots. Press black knob down. Turn anti-clockwise as far as it will go. I'm sealed. Now to build up my pressure again. Remember, I soon let you know when pressure is up because I start hissing steadily like this. This means you turn the heat low and start counting cooking time. We'll give the vegetables five minutes, shall we? That's what it says in my recipe book. Another cold shower now. <laughs> Oh, I'm used to it. I'm a tough baby, I'm telling you. In this way, my pressure is reduced in a matter of seconds. Up with the pressure control. By the way, you can't open me while there is any pressure, so I must have this bath to cool down. Now I'm all dressed up with my service cover. Nice and presentable for dinner. Under 20 minutes, you've cooked a meal more flavorful, more colorful, and more nourishing than anything you ever made before. No wonder Joe wants a second helping, but what does that matter? Mrs. Martin doesn't worry. She knows I can cook enough to feed four or five Joes. You see, they've even written a book about me. A useful book, for it gives you not only the cooking timetables, but recipes for countless exciting dishes. Dishes that you'd think only existed in one's wildest dreams. Oh, I say, a king's banquet. And all this can be cooked by me. Mmm, doesn't it make your mouth water? Aha, Joe's going for that chicken. And I don't blame him. Oh, what a thing to do. Dear, oh dear. Ah, ah well, the boss is free for the evening. He's only had one cooking pan to clean. That's me, and plenty of time in which to do it. And so to bed. Prestige is the name. Hostess model. And don't forget my cousin, the cook's model. He's the chap with the saucepan handle. Goodbye. <laughs>